uh, we are going to talk about uh, the muscles and uh, some other uh, important structures um, of the gluteal region uh, and the thigh uh, on the two plastic models. Now, beginning with this one, this is iliacus, this is seus major, and this one is seus minor. But uh, we can just regard both of them as the seus muscle. And here, in between, we can say that this is the iliopsoas. This is the sartorius. This is the pectineus. This is the adductor longus. And gracilis doesn't seem to be very obvious here. This is the rectus femoris. Um, one of the muscles of the quadriceps femoris this to the lateral is the tensor fascia lata this is the iliotibial tract okay iliotibial tract this is the iliac crest This is the gluteus maximus muscle. Okay, all of that is the gluteus maximus muscle. And here, iliac crest again, gluteus maximus. This is gluteus minimus. And gluteus medius is not obvious here. And this again is the tensor fascia lata. This is pariformis. This is the gemellus superior, gemellus inferior, obturator internus, quadratus femoris. These are tendons. So here again, iliacus, psoas, the iliopsoas, pectineus, adductor longus. Rectus femoris. Now, about the nerve supply uh, to these muscles the iliacus, uh, the sartorius, rectus femoris, pectineus are all supplied through the femoral nerve. The adductor longus is supplied uh, through the obturator nerve. The gluteal region, the tensor fascia lata is supplied through the superior gluteal nerve. The gluteus maximus is supplied through the inferior gluteal nerve. Here again, gluteus maximus is supplied through the inferior gluteal nerve. The gluteus minimus, tensor fascia lata, and also the gluteus medius, which isn't obvious here, are all supplied through the superior gluteal nerve. Pariformis is supplied through the first and second sacral nerves. Uh, all these four muscles, gemellus superior, obturator internus, gemellus inferior, and quadratus femoris are supplied through the sacral plexus.
talking about um, the, the important arteries. This is the common iliac artery. Common iliac artery. It divides into two branches, the internal iliac artery and the external iliac artery. We're gonna take a look at the internal iliac artery on the other uh, model in a minute. Okay, but this is the internal iliac artery and external iliac artery. The external iliac artery um, enters the thigh behind the inguinal ligament and becomes the femoral artery. Femoral artery. And this is the femoral vein. This is also important to know, see, these three structures from lateral to medial, we say nav. Uh, okay, we can memorize it by navigate, nav, nerve, artery, and vein. The most lateral is the femoral vein, uh, sorry, the femoral uh, nerve, uh, the one uh, medially uh, to the the uh, femoral uh, nerve is the femoral artery and the most medial one is the uh, femoral vein. So femoral nerve, femoral artery, femoral vein. Now let's go to the other model. Here we can see the internal iliac artery internal iliac artery it has got some branches this is the obturator artery obturator artery um, passing through the obturator canal obturator canal so uh, this is the uh, obturator uh, foramen okay uh, this is the obturator internus muscle, obturator internus. Um, see, uh, this is the um, this is the pectineal line. This is the uh, part of the pubis, pectineal line, and this is the um, obturator foramen, obturator internus muscle. And this is the uh, obturator canal for passage of the obturator artery. It has got other branches such as the uh, superior and inferior gluteal arteries. Superior and inferior gluteal arteries that uh, pass through the upper part and the lower part of the uh, greater sciatic foramen. This is the pariformis muscle. See, pariformis. And this is the sacral plexus. L4, L5, S1, S2, and S3. L stands for lumbar, so the uh, fourth and fifth lumbar uh, nerves the first, second, and third uh, sacral nerves. They form the sacral plexus. And then, um, the biggest uh, branch of the sacral plexus is the sciatic nerve. Um, okay, sciatic nerve. Uh, but it's not very obvious here. And now, talking about some of the muscles here again. Uh, this is the iliacus. See, this is the iliac crest. Iliacus on the iliac fossa. This is psoas. We can actually say this is the psoas major and psoas minor, but we can regard both of them as the psoas muscle. Here, it would be the iliopsoas. This is the uh, femoral artery, femoral vein. And um, this is the great saphenous vein. The great saphenous vein uh, 
uh, comes up and joins the uh, femoral vein. These are other superficial tributaries that come and join the femoral vein also. The femoral vein and the femoral artery uh, are uh, deeper and uh, eventually they will uh, go down and pass through the uh, adductor hiatus. Um, and some of the other uh, muscles uh, so uh, this is the sartorius this is the rectus femoris this is the uh, vastus lateralis this is tensor fasciolata This is the iliotibial tract. And this is the gluteus maximus muscle.